Good afternoon, Irving High School. Today is Monday, February 25th. This is Will. And Zach, bringing you the news. On the top of our news, congratulations to our Performing Arts Department for receiving the ICE Award for last year's musical, Grease. Remember, seniors, if you want to wear your green cord at graduation, you must turn in your community service folders by March 1st, which is this Friday. You can still get forms from the counseling office. You have until March 1st, which is this Friday, to turn in your forms. Congratulations to our health occupation students who competed in competition at state. The following students will attend the competition in Galveston. Seniors Kiara Brown and Sylvia Casares took first place in CPR and first aid. Freshman Charlie Abrego took second place in biotechnology. And Dr. Bradley students Crystal Cisneros and Julia Quezada placed in state alternative and took fifth place in EMT. Awesome. In other news, Toy Tigers competed in the marching auxiliary competition taking away large ensemble winner trophies. Two sweepstake trophies, choreography award for other modern and hip hop choreography award for team hip hop and POM championship high point award. Well done. Now for the word of the day. Whoa. Whoa. Well, I'm sorry, that was so unplanned, so unattended, such an accident. Or inadvertent. Yeah, sorry, have a good day. You too. Thank you, Shay. That was... Sophomore girls interested in attending summer week-long program at SMU in Dallas. Uh, please see Ms. Tier or Ms. Hernandez in the counseling office for more information. Remember, juniors, that camp rival applications are due by the end of the day today, Monday, the 25th. Don't forget, our annual Black History program is this Thursday night. Don't forget. Don't miss it. Thanks for watching. Now stay tuned for ISPN with Mariana and QT, because she's QT. And we got to change the bell schedule. So remember that. Bye. Good afternoon, Tiger Sports fans. I'm Quinty Tran. And I'm Mariana Espinoza, bringing you your sports news for today. In wrestling news, the team traveled to Austin this weekend to compete in UIL State Wrestling Tournament. Only 16 wrestlers have the opportunity to do so in each weight class, and two of our athletes made it. Monique Cantu and Ina Castro are the first girls ever to do so for the Irving Tigers. We are truly proud of our Lady Tiger wrestling team. Enoch was able to make it down to the final 12 wrestlers, but came up short, while Monique finished among the top 16 for the state. When you see these girls on campus, please congratulate them on a great season and a job well done. Yes, and in tennis news, Michael Juarez defeated Creekview 8-4, Argyle 6-4, and Brian Nelson 7-5 and 6-1 to take home second place in Boise singles. Uriel Baez beat Lake Dallas 8-1, Little Elm 8-1, and Liberty Christian 8-5 to take home first place consolation in Boys B singles. Demonte Burns and Christian Romero defeated Blake Dallas six to three and six to four in Boys B doubles. Adriana Ramirez and Laura Sorto beat Argyle eight to three and Little Elm eight to one in girls A doubles. Grace Lara and Christian Alvarado defeated Sanger six to zero and six to zero and Argyle eight to five to take home third place in mixed B doubles. Way to go varsity tennis team. Keep up the hard work. We're so proud of you. Our sophomore girls had a successful tournament this weekend. They won all of their games, beating Graham 11 to 8, Fossil Ridge 9 to 2, Cleburne 5 and 0, and SA Central 6 to 1. Congratulate these athletes. In soccer news, both our varsity boys and varsity girls smacked Mac. Our boys defeated the Cardinals 4 to 1, and goals were scored by Gerber Chavez, Luis Carballo, Francisco Rangel, and Javier Lejilla. Congratulations to those boys. And also, our girls defeated MacArthur. It was a nail-biter with both teams having several opportunities to score. However, finally in the last three minutes of the game, Laura Gomez fed a ball to Odie Martinez. Odie drained it in the lower left corner of the net, and the defense led by Vanessa Sanchez Partida and Deli Chavez held on to the lead. Jasmine Lewis notched another shutout in goal. 
It was a great team effort. Congratulations to those girls. That concludes our announcements. I'm Quinty Tran. And I'm Mariana. Have a wonderful day.